We'll start by merging these window frames. Left mouse button and drag to the right. Hiding the head front image, create a new background for body front B. We'll set the size to 6.5, 2.3 in X to center it, and 5.8 in Y to position above the origin. It's okay if the head is not centered, as long as the body is lining up. Raising the image up a bit more. The left leg is very close to the center line. We'll follow it for now and adjust the distance later to facilitate rigging. Moving the eyeball geometry to layer 1. Translating everything up to our new reference image. Setting the image to front view. And repeating the same steps to prepare our side view. We'll be adjusting this a bit later. And setting this to right view. In back view, setting up the back reference image. The distance between the left leg and center line here is more ideal. Switching to front view to see how all three images are lining up to each other overall, and setting them up in their respective views. Since this will be the new default placement, we'll apply the location to clear out all values on the head and eyelashes. And we'll leave these ones as is for now. Separate the window for front and right view. Hide this empty, and adjust the head mesh with proportional edit, using the background images as a loose guide only. Adjusting the mesh with subsurf off. And referring back to the head reference for more adjustments.
We'll add a material to the head mesh. Set the specular to about 0 0.05 and name this skin color. We'll also add a material for the eye geometry using just the default values for now and name this white color. Adjusting the shape for the back of the head, which was flattened a bit while matching the reference images. And making final shape adjustments throughout before adding the body 